Hello everybody, my name is Chris and welcome back to more of The Witcher 3. Last episode we find we we find we find Tamara. We find Tamara here <laughs> over in Oxenfurt. We made all our made our way over here. Played some more Gwent. Um the the first off, the music here and the aesthetic in Oxenfurt is amazing. It's so good. It's so good. I I'm actually We didn't have to come here, maybe? I feel like it was optional, but we did. It was great. We got a new haircut. We're ready to take on what's going to come next. Now, we do have the option of going back to the Baron and telling him about his daughter and the fact that she's joined up with the, uh, the Eternal Fire, the Church of Eternal Fire, in exchange for them helping her look for her mom. Now, we have a lead on her mother, Anna. That's here with Hunting a Witch. So we, we're going to go over to Midcops and actually ask around and see if they what they know. We do have a couple side quests. But they're a little bit... I mean, well, most of the quests that we have right now are higher than... Than us like our contracts even we could probably do the woodland beast but um yeah like look at these 20s and 30s in the shrieker treasure hunt we got to do or get too far from that but that is immediately that, that's immediately the focus like we can go back but i think if we can find some information on anna we can tell him about Tamara and Anna at the same time. That way he gets an idea of what we found. Hey there. Like winter on a glass pane. His eyes red. Like embers in a fire. He leaned on me and whispered. Boom! Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, god damn it. That's really good. Whoa there, bro. All right, guys, so we are going to actually stop here on our way. We're stopping by Lindenvale here um, on our way to Midcops because we picked up a contract. And that contract was uh, going to help Dolores and her, uh, her infestation of monsters in her manner. She posted up on the board. So we're gonna go uh, see if we can't help her out on our way to Midcops. Hello, Dolores. What's that about? What's become of me in me elder years? Refused a roof over me head by a common churl. I was born a noble's daughter. My brother and I, we managed the manor for years. Ooh, we just say goodbye. <laughs> All right. Uh, what happened to him? What happened to him? A caller came one day. A drifter, a hunter. It wasn't long before we fell in love and wed. We prepared to leave the manor. My brother, he took offense, refused to bid me farewell. Hmm. Years on, I returned, but found no sign of him. Folk claimed monsters had infested our home. Come to nest there. Oh, jeez. Okay. Uh... Oh, does that mean your brother was still living there? Monsters, we can kill them. I could take care of those monsters for you. Mm. You're a witcher, right? No ordinary man would be so eager. <laughs> Don't fret. It's all the same to me, provided you're honest. The house is east of here. Take this key. Once you've driven off the beasts, look for a chest. My treasure. Savings, really. They're yours. Ooh. What'll that leave you with? A roof over my head is all I need. And if it comes to it, I've other heirlooms to sell. But I know you witchers don't work for free. I could never let you go without honest pay. Gods keep you. <laughs> That's so nice. What a nice person. Wow. The generosity. But we could actually maybe afford things afterwards. That'd be great. Get some upgrades, maybe even some more, some more Gwent cards. Can afford to repair our armor regularly. 
Uh, wow, this manor is is out here. Honestly, aside from the monsters, it's a pretty uh, it's a pretty scenic area. You know, living out here. The manor, the old one oh God. Come on now. All right, you wait here, Roach. Let's see, uh, outhouse is locked. <laughs> Sorry, guys. What the fuck? What was that? Something's not right. Yeah, the explosion outside I was. A monster to set a trap. Someone's here. Oh, we took it pretty well. Oh, look at that. Didn't shut itself. What's happening? Trip to wire. Interesting. So you walk in, the trip wire triggered the door to close. Oh, interesting. I'm beginning to suspect if there's even actually monsters here. A sort of attic. Gotta get up there somehow. Might be just long enough to reach that hey. upper level. Well, suspicious. Let's see what's up there. Can't imagine it's monsters. Huh. Your reflexes have slowed. Hope you're not hurt. Those were my traps. Letho. What? Yeah, didn't expect to see you either. You one of them? One of who? What are you talking about? Why are you here? Old friends, I assume? Well, on the on that bed, it looked like a silver sword. So is he a witcher too? What are you talking about? Why are you here? Uh... What are you talking about? Who's them? To the Emperor, mercenaries. To themselves, bounty hunters. To me, ordinary sons of bitches. <laughs> well, got nothing to fear from me. Took a job from an old woman. Supposed to get rid of the monsters here. Did that already. Count on you remembering that when you collect your pay. Uh... Okay. Weird. Great place to hide. Who's after you? I mean, it is a great place, but she's gonna come back to live here. So, who do you piss off this time? Emperor just decided to get rid of me. I'm an inconvenient witness, after all. I've run into loads of men out to kill me ever since I left Lock Marine. Now I understand all the traps. Gotten real careful. For good reason. Oh shit, what? Don't look a bit like lost travelers. They're not. Means Lewis sold me out. Lewis? Old friend, kinda. Did a few jobs together once a while past. Lewis recommended this place to me. Shit. He recommended this place. Uh. Is Lewis her brother? The uh, Dolores' brother? Sure, he betrayed you? Yeah, you got duped. He probably did, but it, he recommended it, but. Hmm. Are so you sure? Maybe those men down below wound up here by accident. Eat my own boot before I believe that. <laughs> Gotta get rid of them. Coming? You know what? Sure, I'll help. Lead the way. We got a plan of attack? This dude is jacked. <laughs> Improvise. Oh my god, just jumps out of the building. Alright. Shoot. Oh god. Oh yeah, they're headhunters? They really are after him. 
Get him. Oh, there's so many of you. Fucking dude. Came to see if Lewis was telling the truth. Rest must be waiting nearby. And your old pal probably knows where. He was the only one knew I'd be here. Must have told him. Think me and him are due for a little chat. Ah, uh, good luck. Love to see that. I feel like we can get more out of it if we. Interesting. Love to see it. Come along. Decided two witches should loosen his tongue that much quicker. Stay close to me. It's one of those places that's hard to find if you don't know where to look. Yeah. Hold on, I gotta pick up all their sh loose. shit real quick. Somehow doubt he's one of your best friends. Stick closer, Geralt. Oh god, where's Roach? You know how it is in this trade. Drink with someone in the evening. Check if he's robbed you in the morning. Stick closer, Geralt! How'd you meet? Was before Faltas kissed this world goodbye. Lewis was a wanted man in Eddie. Hefty bounty on his head and normal contracts were hard to come by. So I decided to catch the bastard and make some coin. Tracking him down proved easier than killing a drowner. He was, uh, merry-making at the Golden Hanged Man, smack in the middle of Hag. <coughs> Nabbed him, tied him up, but the guard post didn't open till dawn. So we had a few hours. Started talking, killing time. Chat was so nice that once dawn came, I let him go. And that's why you trusted him? Felt he owed you one? I was stupid. <coughs> Stupidity can cost you, but betrayal costs even more. True. That's rough. Shit. So he just, like, tied him up and had a conversation. And that was enough for him to be like, you know what? This is, I can trust him. Sounds right. Oof. But on the bright side, Dolores uh, can go back home. I, I... I will make a point to get back there. Because she, she said that we could take some of the savings that she has. And so far, we didn't do that. Slower. That's walkable cool. Ladies, gentlemen. Greetings. Good to see you, alive and well. Oh, yeah? Of course. <laughs> We're old mates, ain't we? Who's your friend? <laughs> Just come right out. Someone who knows you're a traitor. None of your business. Yeah, we could be, uh, we'll be civil. Geralt of Rivia. Witcher. Another one? What's this? Prime contract available in the area. Sit down. Care for a drink? I don't drink with traitors and rats. Whoa, oh, let's be civil now. Remember, you're on my turn. Arno Vesta's men showed up at the manor. You were the only one knew I was there. They've been nipping at your heels for a while. Said so yourself. Perhaps I finally caught a whiff. Hmm. With your help. You've not been here five minutes, and already you've offended me twice. No insult worthy of scum like you. They are. They're witches! Witches don't attack humans! Oh, shit. Oh, making exceptions. Mistake. Damn it, I missed. Let's go. 
Fuck this guy. Whew. Never really get tired of the executions. <laughs> it's just hardcore. Oh, you're alive still. Lie still or you'll bleed to death. Tell me where Vesto's men are. I'll give you something to staunch the bleeding. They're north of here. Uh, in Lindenvale. Ironic, I was just there. Your traitor makes you a liar too. How much they pay you to double cross him. Yeah. I'm curious. How much does the life of an old mate get you these days? The sinks. Things been shy of late, uh, and we fell afoul of the black ones. Uh, Vesta showed up one day, offered half of the bounty on your head, and a letter of absolution from the Emperor. Hmm. You gotta understand, uh, you don't say no to an offer like that. I understand. I... my medicine! Gotta understand, Lewis. You don't betray men like me. Damn. Time to see Vester going with you. Oh boy. Damn you! Yeah, you're fine. Walk it off. This rabbit dog's here. Now leave me alive. Have mercy. Uh, you'll be fine. What's the worst that's gonna happen? Sorry, I'm just gonna... Just trying to, you know, get everything I can from these guys. You know? No one else is gonna use it. Fancy. Just a broken rake. I, just, I love the idea of Geralt just carrying all this broken ass shit in his backpacks. <laughs> just like, it's it's all trash. But he's just walking around with it. Hey, yeah. Nah, you'll be fine. Slow now. Whoa. Vester. Let's go. Of guardian name. From Metnor, I think. But he's hunted and killed everywhere from the far south to the Dragon Mountains. Why have I never heard of him? Goon goes by different names. Brandon Vilf, Apple Saxon, Manfred Wimplebottoms. <laughs> Manfred Wimplebottoms? Good name for a clown. Once he's <laughs> oh gone in, sure worth laughing. Preferred method, rip the teeth out one by one. And cut the mouth open ear to ear. Oh my god. So they punish deadbeat debtors in the milk guardian underworld. Quite the career. Underworld Jesus. To serving the emperor and his court. Keep your eyes open. Think they're really here? Don't know. But like I said, I've grown real careful. Oh, that sounds so fucking unsettling. Alright, hold on, let's uh. Yeah, I was trying to switch the quest around. Here we go. Set my youngins to pet mushrooms. Nice mounts. Gotta be worth more than the entire village. Oh boy. <laughs> They're doing real nice, money wise. What's in the barn? Hey! <coughs> Got company? Run and find your parents. Tell them to grab whatever's valuable. Take you and flee. Got it? Good. Give this to your mother. Now run. What was that? Compensation. Hmm. Stay here and don't interfere. No matter what happens. Plug your ears. Oh boy. I 
can't gauge if he's like a good dude or... You know, I'm sure he's... He's just upset. What a but... A bolt of lightning or something! Shut up, all of you! Oh boy. <laughs> Letho of Gullet. Good to see you, alive and well. Funny. Second time today I've heard that lie. It is no lie. You will certainly fetch a higher bounty alive. Really? How much? Enough to buy me an estate in Kavir, where I will lie about eating fruit till the end of my days. Not bad. Not every man gets to know the price on his hand. Most men would prefer not to have one. But why have you come? To make my life easier? We were passing by. Decided it was time to finally meet the famous Arnold Vester in person. I am flattered. Shame we'll not get to know one another better. Why? Oh. Going somewhere? No. Simply because I will kill you in a moment. Wanna kill me, but you don't even know me. Not nice. Think I have to punish you for that. But I won't kill you. I'll just cut off your hands. Cut off all your hands. One man after the other. Till the end of your days. Those stumps will remind you of the mistake you made. <laughs> what the hell? You fucking dimwit. I hadn't time to exchange two words with the man. Oh he boy. Provoke me! I mean, he was trying to provoke you, and you fuck. You did it. Y'all messed up. Oh, the kid's like, oh shit. Uh. We have no quarrel with you, but one false move and... And what? You will end like him. What say you to that? Oh, damn, they got him. You know what? You know what? We, oh, oh. What do I say? Simple. You're as good as dead. <laughs> Don't want trouble. I hope he's not actually dead. That would be really shit. All right, come on, guys. Oh, he's done. Come on, bro. There was no chance of that. <laughs> yeah, talking to him afterwards. You good, dude? Hmm. Zinguibarian venom. Something's fishy. I don't know what that is, but it, it's venom. Was he just in like a state of paralysis? Hmm. Oh, a little bit of time. <coughs> you still here? <laughs> They'd have cut your head off if I hadn't been here. Hmm. So you proved useful after all. Could have told me. <laughs> no fun in that. So, wait. Was it... Wait a minute, hold on. <laughs> you amused? Find this amusing? 
Not so loud, Geralt. I just rose from the dead. Zangwebarian venom could still kill you, you know. Got the antidote? Hmm. Saddlebag. Take it in a minute. Couple of days I'll be like new. What was it for, that whole farce? Told you. I'd been on the run since Loch Muin. Loads of pursuers. Got ambushed once, almost died. So I decided it was time to end it. Once and for all. Found Vesto's gang and paid off his arbalist. You just witnessed the rest of the story. Weren't afraid he'd cross you? Is Lewis a part of this plan? Oh. Huh. What about Lewis? Was he part of this plan? Nah, a minor complication. Though his betrayal, it did get me thinking. But I had to risk it. If you hadn't cut down every last witness, I'd be a free man. Letho of Gullet is dead. Word of that would have spread across the continent in days. Wouldn't have done it if you'd let me in on your plan. Told you not to get involved. Well, my plan's in shambles. I should really disappear. I guess... <sighs> yeah, I guess if we knew that that was his plan, we wouldn't have... We would have just like backed off when he was already knocked out on the ground. We would have, like, mm. but we got involved. We killed the rest of them. Damn! So we kind of fucked up his plan. But if he said something, we probably would have just left it alone. Uh, you can go to Care Morin. You know he could, yeah. Hmm. Safe place. You could wait things out at Care Morin with your friends from the School of the Wolf. <laughs> no thanks. Could end badly. Tell them I sent you. They'll understand. Give you space. Care Morhan, you say? Hmm. Why not? Got some loose ends to tie up. But then I'll head there. All right. Hey. Help you somehow? Need anything? No thanks. I'll be fine. So, see you at Care Morhan. See you, Wolf. That's so cool. We actually met another witcher. Letho. That's pretty cool. And so, oh, look at all these Gwent cards. So he is a witcher, but he's not from... He's not from our school of the wolf. He, he seems a little rough around the edges, but he honestly seems just like a nice dude. He's been pursued, so he did this entire thing to like get every everyone off off his back. So I get it. If he if he was being pursued that deep, you know, it it really is just like I get it. You know, I get why you'd want to go silent, try to disappear, because you can't have you can't do anything. Cool, we got those. So, um, we're gonna pop over to the manor real quick, scope it out, and then we're gonna come back here and let Dolores know about uh, everything. That's what we're gonna do. Okay, now it's time to scope around a little bit. I mean, luckily, Letho got rid of the monsters. So that's good. Wonder what door this opens. Sturdy barn key? Was that a, a book on the floor? Does that matter to us? It does not. We got a barn key though. Okay, we can't go in here. It's locked. This is open. Oh. Oh. Oh god. This is not good. That is unfortunate. Okay. Oh, this is what it unlocked. What does that mean? What is this? Somebody lived here once. Is 
Oh, got some. Okay. So, just for looking around? Or can I, can I? Guess not, okay. Hmm. Guess there might, is there another door? It's gotta be, there it is. This is the rest of the barn that we didn't get to really scope out because we met our friend so quickly. Oh, it's a trap. Okay, I don't think there... Okay, there's some stuff over here. Uh, let's check out the top, and then I guess we can go to the main, the main house. Dude really just crashed up here. I guess, you know, he's a monster slayer, so it wasn't really too terrible, probably. And he, he looks like a tough dude, so probably could handle it pretty well. Okay. Okay, well now, is this the main house? Looks... Looks like it. <laughs> now, what is here? We'll see. We got one mug. And some rope. What is it? She specifically said that there was a chest that had her, like, savings in it. Where is that? We're already in this room. Okay, am I missing one of the big... I'm missing, like, the buildings, right? No, I guess... We've been through all of them? Came in there. We've gone through those. This one doesn't open. There's a back door. There is not. Well, I guess there wasn't really anything in a nice way. <laughs> I guess the real reward was the the friendships we made along the way. That was the true reward here. Yet, there's this painting. Hmm. Look like twins. Old woman's brother. Must be. Hmm. Look like twins. Old woman's brother. Must be. Interesting. I like that I can look at it. It doesn't do anything. Got a ladle. If we hmm. look like twins, old woman's brother must be. Must be. Oh, there's something. Oh.
So I can disarm these. I think I sprung every trap when we got here, so. Okay, yeah, uh, been everywhere, so I guess, I guess that was it. Now let's go uh, tell Dolores about the state of her manor and that she can move back home and be safe. Dolores. Oh, you're over here. Hey. Where'd you come from? You've returned. What's become of my home? It's safe. It's safe now. I thank you. This means so much. And perchance did you find my chest? With my treasures? No. Could be someone stole it. Perhaps. Damn. So many years have passed. But go back and search carefully. I've naught else to offer you. I'll do that. Time I was on my way. Gods guide you. Hey, level six. Woo. Good day. All right. Well, completed. Cool. So I don't think there's anything else we can do with her place. Right? Like that was it. Which is fine. Now we have the Woodland Beast and the Witch to look into. Greetings. Wouldn't mind a look at your stock. What do you got, my guy? Oh, what is this? Oh, it's a leader. We already have Emperor Amir, right? Wait, no, we don't. Rearvar Emrys. Look at three random cards from your opponent's hand. Ooh. Oh, that sounds useful. Type bomb, please, next to your card. Double the strength. Okay, I, I want to buy all these, but... We didn't find the treasure, so we don't have a lot of money. Place next to a card with the same name, double the strength. It's a three... Siege combat is great. Commander's Horn doubles the strength of all units in that row. That is a card we can definitely use. We'll buy Emir too. Why not? Um, I think we're good on food. Oh, we can't sell this guy. That oh, makes well. sense. I guess we could sell it to the blacksmith. Ugh. Yeah, let's go. I'm gonna go sell that real quick just to get the weight off. All right, now got that juiced up. Got this. Let's go, Roach. To mid cops. All right. That was quite the distance, but didn't go didn't go too bad. Now we're here. We'll pluck the notice board after we, uh, ask around. Excuse me. Tiny vettles, hungry like a wolf I am. Old woman. Okay, you're, uh, you're struggling right now. Sorry. All right. I've my elf, thank the gods. Should send them back to the witch. I cure him of laziness. Talking Greetings, about the man. witch. Good day to you, sir. Need something? Yep. Got a matter for your village witch. Know where I can find her? I didn't bother with her myself. But ask my man. He'll know. Twerked his back so bad last week he could hardly move. So I sent him to the witch. Came back sprightly as a foal. Where is hmm. he? In the yard, no doubt. Pain's gone, but sleuths set in now. Should be hunting foxberries to feed our young ones. Marion's lad. Now that man, he knows how to provide for his family. Got some water rats last. 
that food for days. Oof. So he went to the witch and now he's lazy. Good day. Heard you know where to find the local witch. Who told you that? Your wife. Daft wench. Leave me be and don't listen to that nattering sow. We've not had a witch, shaman, nor cunning wench in ages. That's... Even if I wanted to spend that, I'm not doing... We... We can convince him. You sure? Give it a think. Won't take no for an answer, will ye? Ooh, alright. <laughs> know the small pond near the village? Path leads off from it. Follow that till you come across a lone rock. Walk around that, then to the woods. Find the old cart. You're there. Thanks. It's just... Don't harm her, sir. Word of your kind's reached these parts. My kind, meaning? Well, the witch-burning kind. What? Witch hunters have been here already? Nay, but we've heard tell of them. So, when I spied you coming, swords and all, straight away, I thought tales must be true. I'm a witcher, not a witch hunter. Hmm? <laughs> what? Not one and the same? No. It's vastly different, I guess. Uh, don't worry. I won't gonna hurt. No need to worry. I'm not out to hurt your witch. Ooh, a weight off me heart, sir. She only arrived a short while ago, but she's frightfully wise. Even pleasant on the eyes. You like them skinny. Thanks for your help. Farewell. I don't know if you went... not 100% sure if uh, you went there for your back. But... Let's, uh... Man, it is storming right now. It's because we talked about the witch. We'll come back for the notice board. I promise. There must be a large storm here. Oh. Damn it. Okay, so this is the pond. Around the way. Oh, it's drizzly. Should be this thing is the big rock. There's the boulder. Now right and on to the cart. Alright. Let's make the right. Oh shit. Got some uh Oh Ew. Ew. Okay, these guys are disgusting. Well I mean they all they all kind of are in a way. Oh that is disturb look at that face. No thank you. Oh. Oh blue mutagen. We can do some interesting stuff with the blue then. Which is hunted somewhere nearby. Okay, we're close. That's a weird way he remembers that, but. Miss! The cows are wheezing. Won't rise from the barn floor. Puss streams from her snout. Do I look like a dairy maid to you? No, miss, <laughs> but you know things. Tis our last cow. None other left in the village. Rest died of hunger. Or soldiers let him off. Oh, we're as good as dead without her. I shall give you herbs. Mix them with water drawn from the spring at midnight, then make the cow drink them. But first, you must clean out your barn. Thoroughly. Is that clear? Thank you, miss. A thousand thanks. Enough. I've had my fill for the day. Go home. <coughs> Interesting. She's in a bad mood. We'd best come back on the morrow. Watch what you say. She's quick to hire. Out to take revenge. Oh, yeah. Bitch is in a proper fury. Needs a man. Well, that is rude. <laughs> God damn. Hello, excuse me. Home. Hmm. One more candle. Oh. She's not here. Ordinary ointment. Nothing special. I'm just gonna go ahead and just peruse. Recipe for black eyeliner. 
When deprived of professional products, one can mix black eyeliner from crushed medicinal charcoal mixed with fresh egg yolk and a drop of lavender oil to keep contaminants at bay. Store the eyeliner in a cool place for at most three days, then make a new batch because the old one has surely rotten, rotted. <laughs> Ingest the remaining medicinal charcoal for it can only do you good. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't know about that. But I, I, I guess charcoal's good for you, right? Now, where's she run off to? I mean, the floor's suspicious, but... Hmm. Managed to amass quite a book collection. That's... A little, uh... A pentacle. A in chalk. Powerful aura. Must be some artifact or... Well, that's intense. So this is what? where she disappeared to. Oh, shit. It's a portal to hell. Probably not, but, you know. We're gonna... We're gonna <laughs> check that out. Uh, darling. I'm writing because you must be worried that I'm still angry. Silly man. You know full well I never hold a grudge long. I forgive you. It's all because of that secretness of yours. Is it so strange for me to take an interest in your plague research? I adore watching you at work in your tower. Please, if you still refuse to discuss the results of your experiments with me, at least don't deny me that small pleasure. If... Versrad... Versarid? <laughs> Doesn't need you tomorrow evening? Come see me, we'll clear things up over a glass of wine. Or two. Or more. Your K. Oh, love letter. Oh god. Anything good down here? Got a little repair kit. And a doll. It's a weird. It's a weird stash. Oh. Hangman's Venom, Twine, and Dimitrium. Nice. You know, we got a recipe, and I think uh, overall that was actually pretty good. Now, what is... Oh my god, it was it was a portal. Holy shit. Wow, wow. Oh. Nice. Oh, this is cool. Oh, this is cool. Okay, she has... There are animals living here. Oh, this is cool. I was wondering how long it would take you, Geralt. I'm upstairs. Don't be shy. Oh, no. She's got this, like... Secret magic hangout. This is actually pretty badass. Great so time, secluded. Sir. You just have... Oh, God. Where? Hope you didn't come to court. Nope. To talk. Turn around <coughs> and wait. God damn it, Carol. That's... <laughs> so she just has this private bathtub up here? Like, that's the whole purpose of this? <laughs> Kira Metz deep in the heart of Velen. Thought you hated the countryside. I can assure you I do. Now more than ever. Kira Metz. Heard a witch lived out here. Never would have guessed it was King Fultest's former advisor. I'm so pleased the world's still able to astound you, Geralt. <laughs> I actually envy you that sense of wonder. Common in children, knights errant, and morons. <laughs> oh my god. Someone's grown okay. evil. Is that any way to greet an old friend? I believe I greeted you with a pleasant view. <laughs> now tell me what brings you here. God damn it. Uh, what are you doing in Valen? Any word from other sorceresses of the lodge? Looking for a certain young woman. Well, we'll start with the... What are you doing here? So, I just saw this question coming. 
What are you doing here? Let me think. Enjoying the country air? Admiring the unspoilt scenery? Or is it furthering the age-old alliance between the city and its breadbasket? No. <coughs> I'm in hiding, Geralt. Blind to the state of the world? Don't you see what's happening? You mean the persecution mages now face? Yes, that's exactly what I mean. Radovid's new pastime. Pursuing anyone with a whiff of magic about them. Oh. Witch hunters. Sound familiar? Murderers scouring the north from end to end. Burning books, hanging soothsayers, torturing herbalists. Good God. Jesus. Why Valen like playing the village witch? Picked a strange place to hide. I didn't pick anything. In the north, Radovid's men hunt sorceresses like fish in a barrel. Nilfgaard controls the south. Where was I to flee? Emperor does keep mages on a short leash, but he lets them live and ply their trade. Radovid and Emma differ in every respect except one. They share a deep hatred of the Lodge of Sorceresses. And I was a member. So the Lodge of Sorceresses, it's like the... So the Lodge is just the word for... that they use... The so collective. how does it feel to be the village witch? Ah, horrid. No joy in having the boundless respect and trust of the local peasantry? <laughs> <laughs> They'd respect anyone who could produce hemorrhoid cream. Been here a while, haven't you? Long enough for rot to set in. You cannot possibly imagine how much I detest this place. <laughs> I mean, the way you're talking, it sounds pretty, Changing the pretty bad. Any word from the others? Any news of your sisters from the lodge? None. We can't know too much about one another these days. It's safer that way. Even tried to contact one another? I've wanted to many times. But I've no way of knowing who would answer. Or who might be listening. I, uh, I guess that would make it real iffy. Like the lost seeing stones. You know. I'm looking for a certain young woman. Oh, really? Who? Siri? Someone who quarreled with a witch. Uh, do we want to say it's Siri? I mean, I don't think she's really going to cause issues if we do, but... Hmm... Well, if they're old friends, they, he would probably take it more seriously if we actually said it was Siri. So we're going to say Siri. I'm looking for Siri. That Siri. And no one can know, understand? Cyrilla is here. The girl once sought by the Lodge of Sorceresses, and practically every ruler on the continent has landed here in Velen, and I know nothing of it. What is she <laughs> doing here? Indications are she's hiding from someone. I heard she quarreled with a witch, but if you don't know anything... Sure you haven't seen her? I'm certain I haven't. But recently, someone asked me about an ashen-haired woman. He claimed she would stand out from the peasant crowd. Hmm. Curious. Okay, so... So Siri has... A hell of a past being... Being wanted... By everyone. Oof. Ash heard, uh, who did the asking? What did he say? Who did it? Who or what did they say? Who was asking? Who was it? <laughs> Not so fast, Geralt. No humble plea. No offering for the witch. <laughs> How's a few dozen eggs sound? What's your rate these days? A couple dozen eggs, three hens, maybe. My rate oh my rises with every word you speak. I'm not sure you can afford the information anymore. Mm, you're pricklier than I remembered. Isn't living in nature's lap supposed to be cleansing, calming? Nature stinks. <laughs> oh, uh, sod it. Don't that's funny. That look. I know it's Siri we're talking about. It was an elf, this individual who asked about Cyrilla. 
No flea bitten Scoyatel slob either, but an elven mage. Curious. Elven mage. That's so specific. And it was Scoyatel. I was I was correct on that pronunciation. Thank God. Uh. <laughs> what was an elven mage doing in Velen? Well, I tried to ask him, of course, about everything. Of course. Oh, but you know how elves are. He asked many more questions than he answered. Okay. Who was it? He say what his name was. He didn't. And he wore a mask. Very secretive all around, but I liked him. <coughs> he was intelligent and composed. He say what he wanted with Siri. Only that they were to meet in Velen. He wished to know if she'd arrived before he did. Interesting. Uh, so this elf might already know her? Do you leave any message for her? No, but he asked that were I to meet her, I should lead her to him. So you know where to find him? Yes, he said he found a hideout in some elven ruins <laughs> near the village of Midcops. I'll go there with you. All right. Why? Think I'll have trouble finding this place? I've unfinished business with this elf. He promised me something, but he never delivered it. Besides, I know you think as I do, and she might be there. And I'd like to see Cyrilla too. <laughs> All right. Can we go? Can't go just yet. Oh. Can we go? Let's go. Let's go then. Let's go. Yes, let's. Ooh. A few hours later. This is the place. Been here before? No. I was hoping the elf would return as he'd promised, or else his waif would appear. At any rate, I've no idea what to expect from this place. Well, let's find out. Great. So it could be great, or it could be terrible. Oof. Plus it's raining outside. Gavella Glan. Oh, you can do magic. Oh, I mean, yeah, she is a witch. She's a sorceress. Ah, oh, shit. Okay, we're continuing this on the next episode. So, man, because I don't, I don't want to spoil anything in here. And I think this is going to get really, it's going to get really interesting. So, for real, thank you everybody so much for watching. Stick around for more Witcher and other games and all that. <laughs> the next episode. Bye-bye.